my flight to New York. I'm so excited. to my hotel in New York. I'm staying at the Soho Grand Hotel, or the Grand Soho Hotel. I'll leave a link to it in the info box in case you are wondering. But as always, I'm gonna be doing a bit of a room tour. I'm first gonna show you the bathroom because it's so cute. So this is the bathroom. It is super duper cute. Here's a cabinet that I've already put some stuff out on. These are just like jewelry bits. My skincare is actually in this which I'm gonna empty. Um, this is the sink. There's a really nice little mirror here. And then this is the rest of the bathroom. Obviously the toilet and the shower. And then this is just like a bathrobe and a hairdryer. Good job I need that because I really need to wash my hair tonight. It's a massive mirror. There's like decor. I'm guessing this is like a conjoining room. Um, but it's closed right now and then it's got this really cute area here. So this is like the mini bar re area <laughs> There's like a little bar thing here some food and the fridge and Then this is the closet. Um, I've put a couple of my jackets up and I've left like a bag Down here, which I'm not going to be needing There's an iron and this you guys is the bed it is so high. Um, and then there's the lamp here. Oh, I've put all my shoes out here as well, so then I just kind of know what I want to wear. I've got some hair bits here, because there's a plug socket right there, so I can do my hair in that mirror. This is my makeup area. I've just left everything on here, because I don't really need to touch up. I might just touch up some concealer, and some lipstick, and then my phone's on charge. And you've got the little bedside tables, and how cute is this little radio thing it's just really sweet i don't know what the view is because the blinds are shut but new york i am in new york because i am here for new york fashion week and to do a little bit of shopping because you can't come to america and not go to an american drugstore and sephora and Ulta and all of those other amazing shops. So that's what I'm here for. Um, I'm going to a couple, actually I think I'm going to about three shows uh, over this past weekend. So I'm going to take you guys all with me and I'm going to show you guys the things that I eat and the things that I'm up to. It's my first time in New York and I am so excited. It's actually kind of hot so I'm quite glad that I've bought like a mixture of clothes. Um, but yeah, I am now going to probably just like freshen up a bit, like brush my teeth and just feel a bit more like at home <laughs> and then I'm going to meet up with the girls and we're going to go get some lunch because it's like, I want to say it's like half one or two o'clock in the afternoon and there's a five hour difference, so it's kind of like my dinner um, and I feel like I've been travelling so much you guys. Obviously I got back from Dubai not so long ago, so yeah I'm going to freshen up and get some food. So guys, I am back from a bit of a lunch kind of shindig. I had some amazing hummus pitta and baba ganoush, which was incredible. Uh, but I've just got ready really, 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 really quickly. I'm wearing the same top and this misguided skirt. And then my shoes are from Public Desire. Um, and I've just kind of like topped up my makeup really, really slightly. Put some falsies on and now I am ready to head out. I'm gonna go for some drinks, some dinner. I know I just ate, but I'm probably just gonna have something really light to like nibble on. I'm gonna pack my bag and then head on downstairs to the lobby to meet the others and then head out. From dinner it's like I'm gonna make up a time I think it's like half ten 
but I am so tired. I feel like dinner was a bit of a blur because of the jet lag, but I'm gonna take my face off and go straight into bed because I am that knackered. Good morning, everybody. It is day two in New York. It's nice and sunny outside. It's supposed to be like thundering and raining today, but so far, so good. I have just got ready. I woke up at like four o'clock in the morning because of the jet lag, and then I forced myself to sleep. So I woke up at like seven. Um, still kind of early, but it's like half eight now. I've been like faffing around. But I'm gonna get something to eat. Today is gonna be a bit of a shopping day. And then I'm gonna go and have a look at the Maybelline Lounge. Yeah, we're gonna go and have a look at that. Gonna see some kind of like sneak peeks. And yeah, today is pretty much a chilled out kind of shopping day. I really wanna hit all of the drugstores and Sephora. I think it's time to get some food because I am a little bit hungry. And then it's time to shop till I drop. <laughs> really cool and I've just had a bit of a sneak peek at some new products that they've launched here in the US they've got these amazing matte lipsticks which I don't think are coming to the UK but they are just so good I'm wearing it right now with a baby lips lip gloss on top because I just had to try them I can't wait for this stuff to come to England so I'm gonna have another little play and yeah I will show you guys some more of the room Hotel. We went to this really, really, really cute coffee place, which is near the hotel, and I've got to say it's one of the best coffee, cappuccino, kind of cafe food place that I've been to ever. I will leave their details in the info box below. It's called the Cupping Room, I believe. I had my brows and my eyeshadow done at the Maybelline Lounge earlier today, so I'm probably just going to top up my makeup a little bit, not too much. But I did go a little bit crazy in Sephora, in Dwayne Reed. Basically, I'm looking to film a haul video for you all. Because I've bought like Morphe palettes and loads of lip products. And the lovely girls at Maybelline New York gave loads of samples of their newbies which are launching soon in the UK. Now I'm just gonna freshen up because I'm going to sort my hair out because it's just like naturally left in the morning. So I'm gonna put some curls into it and change my clothes and all that jazz. So I'm gonna get doing that before heading out to dinner tonight. And we're going to this place called ABC. It's just supposed to be like a really cool like healthy place. So yeah, I'll take you guys all along with me as always. But yeah, I'm gonna stop blabbering and get ready. So I've just gotten ready. The lighting's really bad in the rest of the room, which is why I'm in the bathroom. But I'm wearing my play suit, which I got from Topshop with this misguided belt. And I'm just gonna put my shoes on and then head out. In case you're wondering, all of my eyeshadows are from the Maybelline Nudes palette. It's a mixture of the gold with a crease color. But for the highlight, I have used Becca's Champagne Pop, which is the collaboration with Jaclyn Hill, and I am loving it. It's like a mixture of everything you possibly need in a highlight, which is beautiful. It looks really gold in the palette, but 
actually on. It looks really, really nice. I've also curled my hair. But yeah, I'm gonna get all my stuff ready and then head out. So yeah, I better get doing that now because I don't know where half of my stuff is. So I will see you all at dinner. So it is Sunday morning and I'm off to go and get some breakfast and we're gonna go to our favorite coffee place because I feel like I can sit there and eat food for ages and ages and ages and the food is really good. I am gonna get going because it's getting really late but I guess I will see you all there. with Maybelline for the Derek Lamb show and I've just seen Tom Pichu who's the head makeup artist for the show um, and he's kind of explained the whole look. Um, they've only used mascara on their lower lashes which I think is quite cool. I love putting mascara on my lower lashes and the look is super 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 neutral. Not much contouring, not much on the cheeks, a very neutral lip with just lip liner and the lip liner looks really good but it's like pretty chaotic back here as you can see there's like so many people i'm obsessed with all the new stuff coming out i'm kind of sad that some of the stuff isn't coming to england but that's what the drug stores are here for i'm gonna go and buy loads of stuff it's like really hot really 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 hot i'm gonna stand in front of a fan now now but we are off um, our uber is here I can't walk in this skirt it's like a camel skirt from misguided and I feel like I walk like a penguin it's such a nice skirt but it's so annoying but like we're gonna get into the uber now I'm gonna head there apparently Gigi is gonna be there and also Jordan Dunn which is so exciting and tomorrow I'm gonna be doing like a little mini interview with Jordan I'm so excited but we're gonna head there now I'll try and find out Uber so I'll see you all there. Maybelline party we didn't really want to go out to eat anywhere because we were all so tired but on the way back I found a oh my god this is like pizza hut bag but basically inside there is Taco Bell <laughs> I love Taco Bell I'm gonna eat that really quickly before it gets really really cold and go straight to bed by the way I don't think I spoke to you guys about my lipstick I am obsessed it's the new Maybelline matte lipsticks literally Imagine a Sephora lip stain in a lipstick formula, like it lasts that long and it's super, super matte. I'm obsessed. Tomorrow is the last day here in New York, which I can't quite believe because it's gone so quickly. But yeah, I am going to a couple of shows tomorrow and then I'm also interviewing Jordan Dunn, which I'm so excited about. I met her tonight and she was just so lovely. Like, she was so 
normal and she was just so nice and so sweet so I'm really looking forward to tomorrow uh, but yeah I better stop blabbering and get to bed <laughs> Good morning guys, so um, I am kind of like packing a little bit but we are gonna go and get some breakfast and then we've got backstage access to one show which is the Brock show which I'm really excited about. I'm gonna finish packing once I get back but right now it's time to have some breakfast. I'm gonna make my way downstairs and meet Becky. The last day! in New York today. It's gone so quickly but I need to get going now because otherwise I'm gonna be late and I'm kind of hungry but Taco Bell last night really hit the spot. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna get going now. So let's go. show and we're about to go in to the elevators where Jay-Z and Solange Knowles had their massive argument and we're going inside right now oh my god have a look at the elevator where's the uh, CCTV there's a CCTV in the corner that's what captured them <laughs> I've got like this carry-on bag here. It's basically got my pillow and just like a magazine and things like that just in case if I get bored on the plane. Um, I've got my bag here, my coat and then my bag is ready back there. I'm gonna take all my stuff downstairs and check out and then yeah chill for a bit maybe go have a coffee and say goodbye to the lovely people at our favorite coffee place here um, and yeah just maybe like have a little browse around before we head over to the interview and then it's straight to the airport and it's been like a short but sweet trip and I've really enjoyed every single moment of it but before I blabber on too much I'm gonna get going because I think Becky's already waiting for me downstairs so I'm gonna go before I kind of take up too much time so I'm just gonna get my like phone and charger and stuff and head on downstairs Becky filming and I'm here with one of the most beautiful people I have ever set my eyes on. Oh stop it. No! <laughs> Jordan Dunn! Yeah. Um, so I'm going to be asking you some questions. Uh -huh. I'll do some tips. Okay. Um, because I'm sure my subscribers will love to know the answers to these questions. Okay, cool. So let's do it. Lighting is important, mm -hmm. finding that good light, that natural light. So even when I'm walking the street, if the sun is hitting me, I feel like I just have to like, yeah. oh. okay. <laughs> take that picture. Or if I'm by, I'm like, just in the park. Okay, that's good. So yeah, find the, the best light in the room. Okay. In my house at, in, in London, it's by the patio. So I like, my mum will know when I'm taking a selfie when I'm just like quiet in the living room by the patio. <laughs> and I just see her sneaking, just looking at me and it's just like kind of like, yeah, it's all about the good light and finding your angle. Like, which your best, best side. Okay. I tend to like to like have my tilt. angles like tilt, a nice little tilt. Nice. And smiles. Or sometimes you're smiling one with my teeth, but I tend to just like smile with your eyes. <laughs> okay, well, I feel like everybody is now obsessed with like contouring and yes. it's like everywhere. So like I really love that they really have just like going to be launching this soon and master contour and it has like you know the highlighter the blush and the contour and it shows you where how to, to it, how to do it because I think that's so important because people get kind of confused they don't yeah. know where to put what so like having it shown here it's really easy and also the nude the nude look that I love like again it's like great 
colors and then it shows you the back the combinations that you can use and how to do it so that's like definitely I is like it your favorite out of the blush nudes um i said yeah i tend to go more with the nudes but the blush is so pretty like I the know. colors are so really pretty but yeah i tend to go with the nude and then mascara like maybelline has got the best yeah. mascara so like <laughs> i've gone from like all of them from the great lash yeah. from like last sensational which is like amazing but then now i've now they've got the new one that's coming out soon push up drama which is yeah. really really good and it's like i've really, got it on today you've got it on now do you like it i feel like i just don't need to my lashes right like it instantly just like makes me pull up and up. So, yeah. so. we're in new york mm -hmm. and new york reminds me of friends yeah and friends i don't know if you've watched that one episode where joey plays a game with one of the i think it's like triple chandler um and it's like a quick fire round And this is the London coming out, right? Yeah, I love <laughs> it. I really love it. Okay, uh, full coverage or light coverage? Light. Jeans or sweats? Sweats. Smile or pout? Smile. <laughs> <laughs> Last but not least, red or pink? Red. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm a red, yeah. Those are the questions. Those are good. I like that. I hope you liked it. It's a bit of a mixture of like food and fashion yeah, and makeup. Yeah, it's good. But it's been lovely uh, thank meeting you. Thank you for having you. me. No. I hope you liked being on my channel. Yes. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you. Just finished my little interview with Jordan and she's so lovely. And I've said this already before, but she genuinely is so lovely. I felt like I just wanted to sit there and talk to her just about anything and everything. But we had to get going because we've got to go and catch our flight now. Um, so we're just waiting to go downstairs. And then oh, this is a much bigger elevator. The other one that we got into was a little bit claustrophobic. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to grab our bags and stuff and then head to JFK and then come back home.